Ballet was for decades confined to South Africa's white minority, but it's beginning to find its feet in the country's black townships thanks to a project to train township dance teachers in classical dance. Lessons take place in the heart of Soweto, a hop and a skip from the Hector Peterson Museum dedicated to a key moment in the fight against apartheid, the uprising led by high school students in the year 1976. These dancers in Soweto are part of a new wave of ballet enthusiasts in South Africa's black townships, mastering a dance that for years was reserved for the country's white minority. I also wanted to do uh, ballet when I, when I grew up, but uh, we couldn't because there was no ballet in townships. Uh, we had to go out to town and pay for the lessons. So I was very excited when I heard about this program. One morning a week, Soweto's new ballet teachers are taught by Maria, a dance teacher from Cuba. She's used to training much more experienced teachers and has to be patient with her new recruits. It's a difficult experience for me because in Cuba, teachers have been studying ballet for eight years, but not here. So what do I do? I begin by teaching them the basics of classical dance. Concentration is also very important, as much as passion. Without love, nothing succeeds. Todo lo que se hace con amor se logra, señora. Maria's students become teachers in the afternoon, taking the children through the moves they've just learned. I like dancing more than anything else. It's nice. I like it. It makes me happy. Teaching classical dance in the townships has been the brainchild of South Africa's international ballet competition. And the head of the project isn't hiding his ambitions. The point of the program is indeed to find the ballerinas of the future. When Benjamin Millipied was the director of the Paris Opera, he was talking about the lack of transformation in the Paris Opera. And so I would love in, in eight years or ten years a young kid from this project to land up in the Paris Opera. The project aims to train a thousand black teachers over three years, who in turn will train thousands more children, bringing ballet to a new generation of dancers who've been excluded for so long.